Ouvrage Bracilles. Ouvrage Bracilles is a petit ouvrage of the Maginot line, built as part of the New Front's program to address shortcomings in the line's coverage of the border with Belgium. Like the other three ouvrages near Maubuge, it is built on an old Seer de Rivier's system fortification near the town of Bracilles. The preserved ouvrage La Salle Magne is nearby to the southeast. Bracilles is not open to the public. Seer de Rivier's The original ouvrage de Bracilles was built to the north of Bracilles in 1884 minus 1895 as part of the Seer de Rivier's fortifications of Maubuge. The trapezoidal fort is surrounded by a ditch defended by counter scarps. It was armed with four 95 mm guns and several smaller pieces. The small infantry shelters or a bris house the troops. The position was planned to cover the D228 road. Ursilis was attacked by German forces in 1914 during the siege of Maubuge. Isolated far behind the front lines, it surrendered to the Germans with the other Maubuge fortifications in early September 1914. Design and Construction The Maginot era site was approved in 1934. Work cost 6.4 million francs. Description The Maginot era improvements to Bersilis comprise two combat blocks. The ouvrage was built within the walls of the old ouvrage de Bersilis. An underground gallery connects the two blocks with underground service and barracks spaces along the short gallery. Block 1 Infantry slash entry block with one automatic rifle cloche GFMB, one mixed arms cloche AIM, one grenade launcher cloche LG, one automatic rifle embrasure and one in one machine gun slash 47, anti tank gun JM slash a C 47 embrasure. Block 2 infantry slash entrance block with two GFM cloches, two AIM cloches, and two retractable twin machine gun turrets. A number of small blockhouses are associated with Bersilles, as well as a casemate, casemate de Crevacor, double block with two JM slash C-47 embrasures, two JM embrasures, one AIM cloche, and two GFMB cloches. It is not connected to the ouvrage. Manning The 1940 Manning of the ouvrage under the command of Captain Pugate comprised 97 men, and three officers of the 84th Fortress Infantry Regiment. The units were under the umbrella of the 101st Fortress Infantry Division. First Army Army Group 1. History of the Maginot Ouvrage. See Fortified Sector of Maubuge for a broader discussion of the events of 1940 in the Maubuge sector of the Maginot Line. During the Battle of France in 1940, the invading German forces approached Maubuge from the south and east to the rear of the defensive line. The German 28th Infantry Division moved along the line of fortifications 1922 May, rolling up blockhouses and larger fortifications. Ursilis was under attack on the morning of 22 May. Heavy close-range artillery fire on 23 May destroyed cloches and air intakes. With German troops on top of the ouvrage, Captain Pugade ceased firing and surrendered his garrison. Current condition Ursilis is owned by a hunting society. It is secured, but is not open for sightseeing. It features an unusual number of murals painted by its garrison, which remain in a good state of preservation.